Hey, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can get realistic graphics inside of Roblox Southwest Florida. As you guys can see right now, you're going to be able to get this graphic setting that I'm using right here. Look at this guys. This looks so good. This is before this after, as you can see, looks so much better. And also, let me show you guys the road real quick. A little reflectance on the road right there before after it looks so nice makes the game look like real life almost and uh or it makes the game looks like a lot of other realistic games out there also guys there's gonna be let me show you the preset over here since it's raining i want to show you guys this one actually glossy real quick as you can see it's a raining <laughs> it's a glossiness now it looks like it's the road is wet and everything is wet <laughs> it looks pretty cool you ask me so whatever for today let's get right into it all right so what you're going to do is click the link that's going to be in the description of this video that link will take you to the download um page and also i recommend you guys join extravi's discord server and he's actually the creator of this uh this reshades um just this specific reshades not the row shades itself just the presets that we're going to see here so let's go ahead and uh, install it now it will take you to this link i know it looks weird i know it, i was wondering why is it this but this is it it's um they actually used to have a website let me see if i can find it so here's actually their website as well so actually i recommend just going to the website instead it's called extravi.dev link in the description as you can see it looks really really nice so what you do is now you want to hit download right now it's easy just click it and it'll take you to the same website here as you can see set up and then just download again right there and uh once you've done that it will just install and just download down here if you have chrome or whatever you're using okay so once you've done getting it go to where it downloaded and just look for the zip file which should look something like this what you want to do is right click or click it right click and then click extract all and what you want to do is press extract at the bottom here after that, it'll open up a another folder that looks like this. And inside of this folder, you want to click on into here. And then it, there's a read mean. So let's actually click it. So this is actually, uh, it's just a little uh, disclaimer as well as some information on how to get it to work. Um, I'm just going to tell you everything right now. So first of all, I want to let you know, this is probably the most important. If you have any other shaders you installed, um, um, if you have any other shaders already on, you have to reinstall Roblox to get rid of them. And uh, this is if it's not working, just read up. <laughs> it's going to tell you to read this. But in order to set it up, it's literally right here. Set up extravagant reshade that presets. Um, what you're going to do is double click into the setup, and this will pop up. And that's because this here is a new file. Not a lot of people have used it. Click more info and hit run, anyways. It's not it's not a virus or anything otherwise I wouldn't even be using it all right the setup will look like this click next I accept and make sure all the deeds here are selected you see it says full or custom just make sure you click full and then hit install and this here will install it to your computer and it should not take that long and then you guys here you could join the discord or like this video I recommend you guys do those I've already done both of these so I'm just gonna finish and once you're done, you're, you've installed it. That's pretty much it. It's so easy and simple. Now, there is a couple other steps, so follow along with me. What you're going to do now is hit play. Okay, so first, log into your Roblox. And you can see it says reshade successfully installed. Press F8 to start. Now, I want to say, wait for the game to load up first. But I want to say, if you're a keyboard, if you press an F8 and it's not working, you're going to want to press the F8 key on your keyboard usually it's the bottom left or bottom right in my case it's the bottom right of my keyboard um so where do i get that to work yeah so press f and f8 or just f8 and then you'll see something like this skip the tutorial and now i'm actually gonna go to settings first and use effect overlay and effect toggle click on effect toggle and key bind that to something you don't have to do this step but i recommend key binding that i'm just gonna do zero because i don't use zero that much and then go back to home and then you're going to click on reshape preset and uh, scrolling through this list you will see a lot of presets okay you have ultra light ultra whatever and you have low auto depth of field glossy fake 
RTG that I like that. Now these here over here are all new stuff. Basically, I've never actually haven't used these ones yet. So let's actually take a look at a couple of these. Um, so we have crazy glossy. Let's click select. See what happens when I do this. Um, okay, crazy glossy is like super reflective. Whoa. <laughs> okay then. This looks uh, like <laughs> like a rain, like a hurricane. Let's go to fake RTGI. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Um, let's try um, light depth of field, which also looks pretty nice here. And there's a bit of reflectance and stuff, which is actually nice because it's raining right now here. Let's get a car out here. Now, I don't, this is the new update. I've used the old update because I prefer the old update. But I just wanted to show you guys the new update. Because um, I think a lot of you guys would probably appreciate the new update much better. Okay, so shift here as you can see. Go down here a little bit. Look at that, it's raining. You got a wet road and uh, a nice mercy in the background. Okay, F and F8 again. Right, let's try. We're done. Uh, let's try glossy now. This is just a regular glossy, not the crazy one. So as you can see, it lies reflectance, and this is so much more optimized. So this is actually really good. Just a little bit more glossy on this one. You got low auto depth. This is if you want like a low, obviously. Uh, yeah, low light. Um, and I'm not gonna go through those, but we have RTGI compute shader one auto depth. Okay, um, got another one here, light, and let's just go to the max here, um, there's also ultra, let's do that next, alright, this one, and then you have ultra, let's select that, okay, that looks pretty good, there, I'm actually going to use that feature, and then you have ultra light depth of field, is lighter i guess i mean i'm not really seeing a huge difference here um today so yeah, that's just pretty much it right there extra content so i don't know textures and stuff so don't go through all of that just use these ones right here and also i'm just gonna go to the ultra auto and i'm actually gonna put on i used like a couple other settings here and there but i guess we can't use them on this one so let's just use these settings right here let's hop in our car as you guys can see the game looks so much better like this is before it looks so plain and bland this is after as you can see the lighting is hugely affected a lot more reflectance and a lot of cool stuff to the card and everything and this is really really optimized okay now i know you're gonna need a good pc to run this i um like i'm on max graphics here so I can run it but if you still have like a not that good of a PC you could still run it and try and you could probably get it to work um, it just works fine for me um, in my case because of my PC but as you can see it's working really good So yeah guys, that's pretty much how you get the realistic graphics in Roblox Salus Florida and that's pretty much what I use. I get loads of comments all the time asking how do I get my graphics to look so good. Some people have even asked me if I'm playing on an alpha version or something because my graphics look different and <laughs> I'm not playing on any alpha version. I'm, this is just the reshades as to what it does to your game. Um, and it makes playing Roblox more enjoyable in my opinion. <laughs> Because I play, I don't really play Roblox that much. I play a lot of other games with way better graphics. And, you know, if I want, <laughs> Roblox doesn't look good sometimes. So this helps a lot. And it doesn't only work in Roblox South Florida. It works on any other Roblox game. If you enjoyed the video, please, please go ahead, you know, drop a like, subscribe. Check out some of my other videos. And um, I will see you all in the next video.